guys welcome to the very first day of vlogmas i have been doing vlogmas for i want to say four years now and or this will be my fourth year actually my fifth year no wait i think this is my fifth what that's literally insane when december comes around it's always a really fun exciting but challenging time but i think this year specifically it's kind of going both ways i think it'll be less stressful because i'm not also tackling schoolwork and dealing with finals i'll have more time on my hands to just be doing other things and to be editing these videos but also since i'm not in school it seems like there will be less content or maybe i'm just going to be doing less things especially since we're in the pandemic still like i'm going to be home I'm just warning y'all now like i'm probably going to be home for most of these vlogs i'm kind of worried on how i'm going to keep things interesting but we're going to make it work and i'm excited today it is tuesday december 1st i've actually been up since probably 5 a.m and now it's already 8. i've been in a very consistent schedule of getting into bed super early like 6 p.m when it feels like 10 p.m definitely been sleeping a lot but then it makes me wake up early and then when it's still dark out and it's cold like i don't know what to do with myself i just use that time to catch up on youtube videos i was doing some cyber monday shopping today even though it's tuesday a lot of sites are extending their sales so i did a little bit of christmas shopping this morning <laughs> kind of what i've been up to my plans for today i think i'm gonna go to the track and do like a little running body weight workout which i'll show you guys made it out of the house and it's about 11 o'clock but yeah this morning i just had to tidy up my room fold some laundry took elvis on a nice little walk it's time for some good old me time if you watched the end of my last vlog then you would know that i found out gyms are closing in san francisco again which is why i'm doing this outdoor workout today in the beginning of quarantine and like throughout summer i was coming to the track all the time and it was nice because it was always warm and sunny but now that it's colder um, it's a lot harder to get myself out here. I just have to make sure that I'm always layered up. Minimal equipment for today. I just have my backpack um, with my water bottle and all that. And then my mat. My car is so nice and toasty right now. And I don't want to get out of it. faster run but not like full on it's not like i'm trying to time my mile or anything just wanted to get my body warm and i'm definitely warm the main part of my workout today is going to be sort of like a circuit where i'll be doing a group of exercises run a lap the exercises run a lap and so on probably for a total of four times just so that i do a mile's worth of running again i took some inspiration from a full body sort of circuit that i found on pinterest i'll leave it here for you guys in case you want to try it out but yeah, I'm just gonna stretch a little bit more and then get started.
back home and <coughs> Elvis, shh, shh, shh. Okay, so I'm back home from my workout and I'm gonna call that one the Mile in Hell 2.0 because if you've been around since like around the summertime, <coughs> you might know that I did another workout similar to this called Mile in Hell. I definitely posted it on my Instagram, so if you wanna check that out. Today's workout was very, very similar to this, where in total, I ran a mile, but in between, I'm like doing interval runs. Yeah, it was really good. I'm gonna have some lunch, and luckily... <laughs> oh, this, just let me vlog. Oh my god, yes. The sandwich is like this long, so it's freaking massive. It's good for sharing, good for picnics and all that, so every now and then, we'll just buy it for the house and we'll just eat from it. All these little crackers, too. Probably not the healthiest option, but all these crackers are dry. This is going to satisfy me, and that's all that matters. Mm. Mm. So I showered, and I've just been in bed, just chilling, watching some YouTube, because people are uploading like crazy now. That's like one of the great things about Vlogmas is that not only do I get to do it, but all of my favorite YouTubers are doing it too. I was on my phone for a bit and saw that one of my friends posted their like 2020 Spotify wrapped, which is something that I look forward to every year. I think it's just really interesting to see like what music I've listened to throughout the year, like what my favorite songs are, my favorite genres, how my music taste has evolved, not only throughout this 2020 year, but from years before. So I've got it pulled up on my phone. Let's go through it together in case you guys were curious. Let's see. Discovered 537 new artists in this year. Hmm. I've listened to 401 genres this year. I didn't even know that there were that many genres. Okay, my top genres were number one pop, EDM, rap, chill hop, all that study in college, and contemporary country. All right. The song that got me through it all. Oh my god, Dynamite. Yes, absolute abs abs freaking lutely That's what I was trying to say. As soon as that song came out, I've been listening to it literally nonstop. The story of your 2020 Dynamite. First stream was August 23rd. I don't know if that was the release date or not, but... Days with the most streams, September 15th. Oh my god, total streams. I played it 178 times. <gasps> Yeah, I know that song like the back of my hand. Oh my. <laughs> Three out of the five from BTS. That's so funny. Pretty Basic is number two. Hey. I'm a tastemaker. What does that mean? 126 of your playlist gained 43,000 followers. Compared to other listeners, which decade did you play the most? I want to say like. 70s? Oh, wait, 80s, maybe 80s. Oh, 2000s. Who was by your side in 2020 other than your husband's? My top artist, oh, it's probably BTS. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. I spent. 2600 minutes listening to their music. Oh, I love this. Oh my god. These are my top artists, my top songs, minutes listen, and my top genre. 2020, baby. It's been a great year of music, and I feel like music has really gotten me through these tough, lonely, sad times. Oh, that was. I love that Spotify does this. I don't know if Apple Music does. I'm sure they do something similar. But let me know what your guys' like, top artists, top songs are. I'm very curious to know. Maybe we have the same music tastes. Maybe we don't. But for the most part, I'm very open-minded when it comes to music. Like, I literally love all genres. I love it all. Give me the pop. Give me the hip-hop. R&B. Country. K-pop. All the above. Everything in between. <laughs> Alright, guys. So that is going to wrap up day one of Vlogmas. Yes. And I... Oh, ow, 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 ow. I feel like in my hair. Okay, I literally just finished editing everything. I have my intro all put together. Yay! It took me about four attempts getting copyrighted every time before I settled on this one. And yes, I kind of settled because honestly, it's not as fun and upbeat as I would like it to be, but what can you do? But yes, I'm gonna sign off now. It's 11:20, which is great. Let me know 
what you guys want to see in these next videos. I'll definitely include more of my workouts like what you saw in today's video. If you want to see fashion, makeup, cooking, even though I'm really not a good cook, I can try for y'all. Let me know and we can, we can get that sorted out. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already. And yeah, thank you guys so much for tuning in on this first day of Vlogmas. I'm very, very thankful for each and every one of you. So all these videos and the time editing for this month to come, it's, it's for you. Yeah. Thank you guys again for watching. That is it for this video. I will see you guys in the next one.